on the B site could be enough to get them through this map. Let's see as they start to descend then down that round. The smoke will obscure Snappy's vision. A flashbang as well forces him to back away and gives them some control of the site. Nico, however, has dedicated himself. And oh my, oh what my is this? god, mouse sports! Oh. The cheeky beans! They've come straight around. They're going for the cheese this time on A. And Moddy, he didn't flinch. He didn't move a muscle. Neither did the majority of the CTs. They're coming in from T1, T2. But Oscar's here to receive at least one and a two. This is looking brutal. Chris Chase is going to get a double himself. What a tactic this has been, Alex. Will be Nico trying to pick up the pieces here, but he's in a five on one situation. Now four on one. Could find one more kill towards Ivy, but this was something I've never seen before. <laughs> Going good. all the way through inside, but we'll see whether Nico can just get any more damage done before I start analyzing this one. He does go down eventually, so let's just break that down. We had four players going towards the inside upper halls, showing presence, smoking towards connector. We then had one player at the Ivy position, ready, which I thought would be showing attention towards that side of the match and sure. presence, and then maybe come for a backstab or just trying to pull a rotation over. No, they smoke connector. They push down the lower ramp all the way in. They have full control of the inside side. No one's there. They go towards connector. Three players go in, pincer the outside bomb site, get the bomb down, and that's a really nice avant-garde strategy I haven't seen before.